I have read all of the Walking Dead comics, except for one called uh, Negan Lives, but this Telltale series is supposed to take place in the comics universe, but not the show. Uh, is this the farm? Well, that was fast. I don't remember the farm being this early in the game. I thought this was actually an episode too. I guess I was wrong. Oh boy. Oh, he still has the barn too. Oh boy. I'm gonna run on home. My mama's gonna be in a snit. No sweat, man. I'll catch you tomorrow night. It was nice to meet you both. Nice to meet you too, whatever your name was. Honestly, I like the depiction of the farm in the show more than I do the comic. But Herschel in the show is so much better than the comic. Down the way, things like mayor's gone. I like them both, though. I wouldn't have made it back without Chet. Well, Chet, that's the dude's name. Took him with you, then. I don't even think he's in a comic he's like a normally. Yeah, we need some help, man. We just need a little help. We won't stay long. Good. You're welcome to stay here, but just for the night. I don't run a bed and breakfast. That's so that's fair. Your daughter, then. Oh, not his daughter. He's. Well, just some guy who found her alone. Honey, do you know this man? Yes. A little. She knows me a little hey, bit. Well, looks like you hurt your leg pretty bad there. I appreciate Herschel checking to make sure that I didn't, like, kidnap her or do something worse. I can help you out. Sean, Herschel's not a bad guy. You take a seat up on the porch and I'll go see what I have. Although he can be a bit of a prick sometimes. Let's have a look. Yeah, this is swollen to hell. Yeah, did a number. It hurts like hell, I'd like imagine. You. I bet it does. What did you say your name was? It's Lee. Nice to meet you, Lee. I'm Herschel Green. Herschel! How'd this happen? Uh, car accident. That's so. Where were you headed before the car accident? Uh, out of Atlanta. The news. I think. I'm not actually completely sure. Mistake. We hit a guy. One of those things you've been hearing about on the road. Who were you with, the girl? Nah, uh, maybe I shouldn't tell him I was with a cop. So, yeah, Ooh. it is. I don't he think he believes me. That's all. House is full up with mine. We got another displaced family of three sleeping in the barn. You and your daughter are welcome to rest there. We're done here. Oh, okay. So this is gone. this is like significantly before the comic. Then, um, imagine what you when they meet comic time. or when they meet um, Herschel in the comic. After until we uh, find their parents. Hey, Dad. So I'm thinking, first thing tomorrow, we gotta reinforce the fence around the farm. See, the fences are important. Necessary. I don't know what you saw on TV or heard on the radio, but there's some serious shit hitting the fan. I don't think anyone knows how big it is yet. Don't swear in front of Clementine. No, he's right. Your son's right. You're gonna want to fortify this place. Stuff like that doesn't happen around here, Sean. Dad, I'm serious. Lee, come on. Tell him what you saw out there, man. I saw some shit, Herschel. Uh, I guess that. Chased by a couple of dead people. It was more than a couple. Would you think you should? We got plenty of chores as it is. Lee and those folks in the barn can help out in the morning. We got to do it, really. I already. I'm all for helping him. Well, I'm all done here. It should start to feel better tomorrow. Thanks. And if your leg gets hot or the swelling doesn't go down, you're probably dealing with an infection. Well, that's not good. What do we do then? We'll probably just have to shoot you. <laughs> That's a messed we'll up joke. It, redress it and you'll be fine. Okay, that'd be preferable. There's blankets and such in the barn. Come on, Lee, you can't take a joke. Right early. Come tomorrow, which way you think you're headed? Towards making, I suppose. I don't remember if that's where Clementine said her parents were. Oh, right then. The barn. Herschel's barn. It's 
smells like. Uh, manure. <laughs> manure? Like when a horse plops? Yeah. Like not, I'm not gonna teach her swear words so just yet. Oh. Poor kid. How far is Savannah? Pretty far. Uh, yeah. hell if I know. Okay. I'm terrible when it comes to geography. He's having weird dreams, or I guess it's more of a nightmare, really. I don't think Lee is necessarily the best person, but I like him. There was a reason he was in that cop car. Hey, get up! Oh, it's uh, what's? I think I think his name is Kenny. You slept in a barn, little lady. Lucky you don't have spiders in your hair. <laughs> but I bet your daddy scared them all away, huh? I'm uh, not her dad. Babe sleep. I'm Kenny. Dad, we're Kenny. The fence, there's a tractor and everything. Oh, I hate this kid. This kid's Where annoying. Going, or we won't hear the end of it. Clementine's way better. That's my boy, Ken Jr. Ken Jr. sucks. Doc? Oh. Yeah, nothing bothers him. Like water. I didn't even. I don't think I actually pushed a button there, but okay. No kidding. But frankly, I think it's because he's dumb as a bag of hammers. Dad! But he makes up for it with enthusiasm. The word is you were on your way to Macon. Yeah. Well, from there. well, Macon's on the way, and personally, I'd appreciate the company of a guy who can knock a couple of heads together if he has to. Yeah, it's probably best to stand like a small group. Uh, yes. Sure, we'll tag along. It's a plan then. Honey, Duck, this is Lee. And, uh, what's the girl's name? Clementine. Clementine. Clementine! That is a very pretty name. Thanks. Well, we should get to work. It's a pretty we unique name. Those things can do out there, so the faster we get this fence up, the better. I want to build a fence. Yeah? Good for oh, you, Duck. Good, good for you. You can sit on the tractor and yell at me whenever I take a water break. On the tractor? Cool! Duck and I will hop to it. I think part of his... I don't like... Duck the I way that like character acts and place. the voice actor. We can visit. Like nothing against the people who worked on that part or just like you know the voice actor. It's just it it wasn't a great fit in my opinion. I think it could have been a bit better. Hey there, girls. Uh, what do you do? So, uh, what do you do when corpses aren't walking around? That's not what I was thinking. The question was. Like Herschel here, except more with dogs and cats, and uh, not horses. What is it that you do, Lee? That's not as fun. I used to teach up at the University of Georgia. Okay, so he was a we professor. We need to hope that we can go back to our jobs soon, Lee. Back to normal. It can't stay like this. I learned she's a veterinarian. Uh, no, no I'm used to. I was let go a little while back. Too bad. Well... I hear people always clamor back to college after a big disaster. People don't want to die ignorant, I guess. Uh, I'm just gonna exit. <laughs> okay, Lee. In my defense, I probably didn't have tenure, so they fired me. That's it. Could be worse. What are you up to, Duck? Okay. I guess I'll talk to him. How you doing, Doc? Good. I'm going to drive the tractor. I'm the foreman. Lift with your back, Sean. Ah, oh, Doc, you're just so annoying. You know how to drive it? Sure don't. I can give you a hell of a critique of the U.S. Farm Bureau. I'm mm -hmm. good. <laughs> Professor shining through. Really? Need a hand? I'm trying to be useful here. That'd be great. If you could cut those two bites to length, that sure speed things up. Sure. I'm in real life. I'm like a little handy. I don't like doing the work though. <laughs> I used to take engineering classes and like kind of wood shop back in high school. A boy just shot him right in the face. Oh. Uh, I mean, damn. Like, what else is there to say, man? He didn't even hesitate. He just turned, put the barrel of the gun right between the kid's eyes, 
and pull the trigger. That's you messed up. Things like that. It's not like in the movies. They don't fall like you think. Did you have to do it? Do what? Kill. Have you had to off one yet? Oh. Uh, the cop, yeah. Uh, I had to. Uh, yeah, I had to shoot one. Shoot one. I could shoot one. More than just one, kind of. If it were far away. There was the. I'm just glad we're getting one in Town's house too. Dad just wants to keep the family safe and thinks inviting people in is a bigger threat than whatever's out there. How about yours? How's your family? Phew, destroyed. I didn't I actually know he had a brother. I hope. Oh man, I hope so too. Maybe it's not too bad there. That's probably all I need cut for now. Thanks. I'm just trying to help you. Uh, what's this here? Do you uh, think this thing will keep them out? Not yet. I'm planning on coming back through on a fortification pass, if you will. We'll lock this place up good. I don't think he's exactly the handiest person. That doesn't look right to me. Like, why do you have three right there and then like a metal... Or is that just a door? I don't know. His, his craftsmanship needs work. What's in the barn? Oh. Getting a little weird with the... Okay, I guess I can't walk that way. Alright. I don't think it wanted me to be in there. What is around here? Oh. What are you up to, it's Kenny? Not the most reliable pickup in the world, but it gets the job done. Kenny is actually one of my favorite characters in this, uh, in this series. Shit, but Paul's all right. He's just, like, so complicated. Hey there, uh, and hey flawed there. at the same time. Uh... I guess I'll ask him if he needs any help. No, I think I got it. Yeah. Do you need any help? What do you mean? I mean in taking care of that little girl. You know what you're doing? You got kids of your own? I'm just winging it, man. I think I've got it handled okay. As long as I keep her safe, I think I'm doing all right. With those things out there, maybe. Sure, that's enough. But you gotta ask yourself if you're the type of guy who can do better than that if her parents don't show up. Ooh, that's that really mind. landed on thick there, Kenny. Yeah, what what, what about you tell me what your plan is? So what's your family's plan? Get back on down to Lauderdale and let this mess get sorted out. The government will start handing out shots and the National Guard will do its thing. On the odd chance things got too bad, we could... Hop on my boat, I guess. Ooh, You've got a boat. he's got a boat. I'm a commercial fisherman, catching mackerel, dolphin, whatever's biting and paying. Katya wouldn't be wild about it, but the boat's not that bad. As long as it's safe, I mean, that's really what's important there. How's your son doing? Good, I think. Katya's got a sister up in Memphis. We were coming back from visiting her. We were in a gas station, and some guy grabbed my boy. Oh, boy. I thought he was kidnapping him. I was on the fucker in about two seconds, and... Christ. Just lucky I was there. We saw a lot of bodies before we stumbled upon Herschel's. But See, that's why I like... That's why I like Kenny. Like, he's a family man. He's very protective of his son. Let's see. What else is there to talk about with you two? Uh, how is the city? Asking the real questions. We passed so many people that needed help, and we just passed people. Over some, just, just. Over it's some. Okay. That's kind of messed up. You don't have to say anymore. I want to go home tomorrow, but even then, I can't take away the things we, the things Doc went through. Yeah. Don't you want to go back to the moment before you knew about all of this? Uh. Anybody in their right mind would. I mean, the moment right before this, Lee was gonna go to jail. So I guess. Those are the things we live for, right? With those gone, what's the point? Or maybe he was gonna go to court. I'm still not completely clear on what was going on there. I think we're doing just fine. Clementine was just telling me about first grade. Oh, um, how was that? Didn't it's she eight though? Well, yeah. So she should be in like third grade so or second. Anyway, it's almost like we didn't see people eating each other for the past three days. It's peaceful. Back in a bit. I don't actually remember how old I was in third or fourth grade. I want to say, I think I had just turned eight for third grade, 
or I was, or I had just turned eight for uh, fourth grade. Uh, I don't really know where to go here. <laughs> I think I already went this way. Maybe. What are you up to, you Duck? Doing, Duck? Good. I'm gonna drive the tractor. Oh gosh, I don't want to hear that again, Duck. Lift with your back, Sean. Wow. Okay, Duck. How Good for you. To drive? Awesome. Pain in the ass mostly. Huh? Big, heavy as hell, and slower than. Uh... What else is there for me to do? Still need a hand? I'm good. Maybe go check on my dad in the barn. Oh, it, okay. I tried going in the barn though, and it didn't do anything. Okay, now he's in the barn. He wasn't there earlier. Oh. What's up, Herschel? That if you weren't leaving with Kenny today, I wouldn't stand for your lack of honesty last night. Damn, dude. I'm not sure I follow. I ain't dumb. I caught you in that lie last night about who you were with in that car. Damn. And honestly, I don't even want to know. How'd you get out of Atlanta? Oh, that was on my way out anyway. On my way out anyway. The timing of all this just happened to be right. Huh. If there ever is a good time for the supposed apocalypse. Yeah. I'm pretty sure Kenny or uh, Herschel's like fairly religious. <laughs> Twenty years ago, I'd still be doing this. I would have told you that you were full of crap. Yeah, huh. there was a plan having a place like this. It was in the family, and I guess so was I. Family's yeah. important. That's all that matters. Could have turned into like a ranch Maybe instead of a farm. Was brought up to, yes. Where's your family now? Parents, wife, girlfriend. Uh, I guess well, his parents are in Macon. With my brother. Well, I hope they're all right. But now you've got this little girl to take care of. Clementine, is it? You just stumbled up on her. Yeah, I was being attacked. Being attacked and she came to my rescue. She saved me, Kenny, or Herschel. I keep calling him Kenny Baxton. A piece of advice. I guess. Sure. I don't know who you are or what you did, but you better become a better liar and fast. What? Let's say things don't get better. That wasn't a lie, though. Or they get worse before they do. You're gonna have. That wasn't a lie. Must be a stranger. And if those same people get to questioning yours, you're gonna be in trouble. So whoever you are and whatever you did, keep it to your damn self. That was not a lie, though. At least you have the common sense to listen to a man giving you advice. See, like, like I said before, Herschel is a bit of a prick, but he's a good guy. Oh damn! Oh no! Ooh! Oh, you duck, why? I gotta save the kid! Even though I don't like him. Come on! Get him, get him, get him! I'm sorry, duck. Oh, shit. What the hell, Kenny? Come on, your son caused this too. No! Sean! Aww. No. See, this is why you fortify the fence. Oh, and Clementine has to watch this too. No. Oh, I feel so bad for Herschel. In the comic, Herschel loses so many people. And in the show, too. It's just like, in, in just overall, Herschel loses. Oh. Yep, that's our cue to bounce. Sorry! Your son is alive. You don't get to be sorry! Yeah. You! You didn't even try to help. That's a lot. Uh... I tried helping them both. I thought I could help them both. You thought wrong. And now I'm sorry, Herschel. I didn't want Sean to die. Just go. Get out and never come back. Oh. 
Yeah, that's probably the right call. But what happens later is, uh, I don't think we actually ever see Herschel again in the game, but in the comic and the show, he ends up leaving yeah, with, like, the main point. character. He has a huge family, though, and, uh, they all kind of become characters. Yeah. It's a sad day at Herschel's farm. It's supposed to be a happy place, damn it. 